for a little period, the technological world stood still. Um, even so, a Revelation A momentous event has occurred recently. History is not written every day, but it's being rewritten in a way that will drastically alter our future. Musk, Elon, it's easy to just go straight to the like optimist bot as a person working in my house and doing my chores thought process. But there are a lot of useful things that can come out of whatever that foundation model is that the Optimus bot is built on. It's both embodied and non-embodied things. Like there's an incredible amount of services and I don't see anyone else attacking this problem in this way that, you know, here's the mastermind behind some of the most groundbreaking innovations of our time has just dropped a bombshell on the Tesla bot. What could this mean for the world of robotics and automation and for us as a society? The implications are vast. The possibilities, endless, the short answer for now, is that I think it will take longer than the end of this year. I'm hoping that we see something really impressive by the end of 2024 and that it will basically become clear at that point that this is going to happen and that it's just a matter of time that all of the capabilities of the system are there and they're ready and that there's just some polishing work that needs to be done. OpenAI and a host of open source companies are trying to progress, basically. Uh, hold on to your seats as we reveal the technology, vision, and secrets behind this historic revelation. Join us as we explore the core of this amazing invention and see if you're prepared to take a step into the future. This is a significant development in human-robot interaction, not simply news. But before we get started, make sure to hit that like and subscribe to Tesla Stock News. Welcome to Tesla Stock News. Let's embark on this incredible trip together. In an exciting recent interview, we'll dive into Tesla's outstanding development in China, particularly at their Giga Shanghai plan. Vice President of Tesla in China, Grace, offered some eye-opening information. To start, Giga Shanghai's production efficiency is incredible. They can now produce a car every 30 seconds, and they've nearly reached full automation in the building area, which is quite an accomplishment. Uh, we're also examining China's Audacious initiative to develop humanoid robots, a concept that Tesla is excited to pursue. Hans Nelson, a mechanical engineer who is enthusiastic about Tesla's endeavors, joins us, the creator of the Hansi Nelson YouTube channel. Hans contributes his extensive experience to our discussion. Your creation of the Model 3 Highland in Shanghai's RV Innovation Center is a major highlight of Grace 2A. It highlights the center's critical position in Tesla's design and production as well as its influence over other Tesla facilities. Hans Nelson gives us his take on this strategy, stressing its value for both internal acknowledgement and PR in China. We're also tackling Tesla's dedication to data privacy and security in China. They're keeping all car generated data local in line with Chinese government rules. This shows Tesla's forward thinking approach to data handling and privacy concerns worldwide. Then we turn to Tesla's strides in efficiency and automation in just half a year, Tesla slashed their car production time from 40 to 30 seconds, a huge step up in operational efficiency. Furthermore, the near complete automation in the welding workshop and the faster production and DIGA casting are clear indicators of Tesla's continuous drive for innovation. Now, let's explore. Is a strategic importance of Tesla is Shanghai Niat Pack Factory. Within its worldwide operations specializing in nickel, cobalt, and aluminum packs, this facility is a key player in Tesla's battery supply chain. Its importance lies not just in its production capacity, but also also in its positioning in Shanghai, a nexus of tech innovation and manufacturing the factories. Expansion signals Tesla's dedication to ramping up its battery production crucial for meeting the increasing demand for electric vehicles worldwide, particularly as the automotive industry shifts to electrification is remarkable. In particular, the attention that NEEP factories pay to nickel, Cobalt and aluminum is noteworthy. These materials are essential for high energy density batteries, which are essential for improving the performance and range of electric vehicles. Now, this strategic location helps Tesla cut production costs and boost supply chain efficiency, further solidifying its competitive edge globally. However, the Shanghai Neap Nap factory's significance goes beyond manufacturing. It is a testament to Tesla's dedication to innovation and sustainability anticipated to employ as the industry gradually shifts from traditional lithium ion batteries. Uh, Tesla's investment here secures a steady supply of these key materials increasingly vital as the industry gradually shifts from traditional lithium ion batteries. Modern manufacturing techniques and technologies are used at the factory to reduce its environmental impact in line with Tesla's sustainable energy goals. Although it can be 
difficult understanding the complexities of Tesla's bot and its production is essential for the company's future. Fortunately, our partners at Seeking Alpha offer in-depth analysis to demystify these and other complex topics. Their in-depth study simplifies the subtleties so you can grasp the ramifications for Tesla and its future direction for a thorough grasp of these important concerns. Go to Seeking Alpha. Visit the description link to get a unique deal designed just for our audience. In the constantly changing automotive landscape, Tesla's ability to produce more vehicles with lower capital investment and operational expenses positions. It remarkably against its competitors, this efficiency contrasts sharply with that of companies such as Bide, which despite their success in selling affordable vehicles, faces higher fixed costs as a result of having a larger workforce. Conversely, Tesla is reducing production costs to provide entry-level cars with superior profit structures that outperform after discussing competitors like Bide and other significant Chinese manufacturers. The topic of discussion turns to Tesla's massive factory in Shanghai, which is ideally positioned for worldwide distribution. This action takes advantage of China's standing as a major manufacturing hub, particularly in the creation of lithium ion batteries, which are essential to Tesla's energy industry. The production of the Megapack plant is expected to surpass that of current facilities serving the international market. Next, we look at China's ambitious aspirations for humanoid robots. In order to achieve mass production by 2025 and global leadership by 2027, the Chinese Ministry of Industry and Information Technology has outlined a roadmap for rapid development in this field. Part of this plan involves creating a centralized innovation system for humanoid robots that focuses on critical technologies and guarantees a supply of essential components. The project emphasizes the importance of humanoid robots in production and sees them as a new engine of economic progress. China's uh, assertive stance in this field is perceived as a reaction to Elon Musk's pioneering work in humanoid robotics. The governance plan recognizes how humanoid robots could revolutionize international industry, emphasizing the role of technology in the economy of the future. These trends highlight how quickly and dynamically the automotive and technology industries are changing and how advances automation and robotics are revolutionizing entire industries and economies. We also examine the implications of Tesla's technological innovations, particularly with regard to optimus and fully autonomous driving and how they will affect the global economy going forward. Let's switch to the United States, where the automotive industry is significantly different. And see how China's focus on humanoid robot development is a strategic response to demographic challenges and competitive pressures like the labor shortage resulting from the one-child policy. Uh, in contrast to the American situation, Ross Gerber, uh, U.S. Director at investment firm Gerber Kawasaki highlights ongoing union negotiations and recent deals in the traditional auto industry. While the U.S. is embroiled in union dynamics, Gerber notes that the rest of the world, including Tesla, is moving towards greater automation. The discussion delves deeply into the assembly process of each Tesla model, demonstrating Tesla's readiness to incorporate humanoid robots into manufacturing. This section of the discussion focuses on how efficiently and streamlined Tesla's production is. Opening the door to a more successful robot integration, Gerber shares his thoughts on the potential effects of unionization on Tesla's automation approach. Uh, he suggests that Tesla's dedication to automation and technology is fundamental and not just a response to pressure from the union. Putting employee compensation front and center offering stock options to staff members is part of Tesla's plan to avoid unionization at newly constructed facilities like Giga Berlin. Develops a workforce that is devoted to Tesla's goals and success in the future industry. Insiders note that this strategy is essential for preserving a driven team's faith in Tesla's direction and the possibility for substantial profits from stock options, examining the manufacturing excellence. Tesla AutoLine offers a perceptive evaluation of Tesla's Model Y's construction, emphasizing the company's modular vehicle assembly method, which is intended to be both simple and effective. This modular architecture creates the framework for future integration of humanoid robots while also making duties for human workers easier. An expert in business development explains how Tesla's Model S and Model I are modular, pointing out that the use of a single large jug of casting piece makes it possible 
to assemble the models from the inside out, streamlining the process and lowering the number of parts needed. The cooling beam, a crucial component used in all Tesla models, undergoes minor adjustments to ensure seamless integration of changes across all models. Why? Because of Tesla's creative design assembly is simpler and more effective because all bolts are positioned from top to bottom. Pokyo procedures are used to guarantee proper part fitting and reduce errors, particularly for novices. Additionally, Tesla's designs include air filter that quickly snaps together without the need for additional fasteners and offers plenty of room for workers to focus on safety and ease of assembly. Uh, this analysis of Tesla's production process shows the company's inventive approach to vehicle assembly and a readiness to adopt cutting edge technologies like humanoid robotics. An important accomplishment for Tesla is its manufacturing efficiency. The conversation raises a crucial query regarding the possibility of robotic automation in Tesla's manufacturing lines, given that the company's design philosophy is perfectly adapted for such advances in technology. Uh, upon closer inspection, we see that Tesla's success results from a special synergy between design and manufacturing, whereas in many other organizations, there is a gap between the two. Designer engineers frequently operate independently of the manufacturing process, which results in designs that are impractical and difficult for manufacturing engineers to implement. This can in turn, cause assembly line workers to struggle with tough and inefficient duties from the outset. Tesla's uh, strategy entails design engineers collaborating closely with assembly line workers to produce practical ergonomic designs that are simple for humans to assemble and consequently easier to automate. This kind of integration is uncommon in the industry. Having previously been observed in organizations like Boeing and Elon Musk's closed Martin Skunk Works, Tesla's production process is centered on simplification and optimization through part reduction, function merger, and continuous iteration. The production process at Tesla is intended to be both efficient for human workers and ripe for automation. This idea is expressed in the statement, the factory is the product. Speed and simplicity are essential to Tesla's ability to manufacture cars or aiming for a car every 30 seconds, significantly faster than the industry standard. With recent remarks made by Tesla's vice president in China, it is especially pertinent that the company places a strong emphasis on simplification, uh, which both helps human labor and creates the foundation for robot integration. Grace talks on the growth of meatpack manufacturing and the effectiveness of Giga Shanghai. As we come to an end, we are reminded of Tesla's continuous pursuit of innovation and efficiency from Giga Shanghai's operational achievements to the strategic significance of the Shanghai meatpack factory. In addition, with China's push for humanoid robots, Tesla's streamlined assembly process is well paused position for future innovations. <sighs> We're left wondering how Tesla's ongoing innovations will influence the global automotive industry, the impact of humanoid robotics on manufacturing, and in the way Tesla's current strategies will shape the future of sustainable transportation. Tesla is fundamentally changing. Automotive industry. The company's fusion of design and manufacturing, its employee compensation strategy, and its anticipation of technologies like humanoid robotics all depict a company not just adapting to the future, be post your ideas in the comments area and don't forget to like and receive more updates and insights sign up for tesla stock news thank you for watching and please return soon for more tesla news in our next videos